There are many diseases and disorders which affect the brain, one of them being autism spectrum disorder. This is a developmental disorder that affects behavior and communication. It impacts how an individual socializes and perceives interactions with others. The spectrum of autism is very wide and everyone who is diagnosed with ASD does not experience the same symptoms. There are individuals with ASD that are super talkative and want to engage with others, and on the other side of the spectrum there are individuals who are nonverbal and like to keep to themselves. ASD comes with many different challenges that the individual struggles with on a daily basis. These challenges include but are not limited to social phobia, avoidance behaviors, meltdowns, repetitive behaviors, obsession, impulsivity, or hyperactivity. Autistic individuals can be highly sensitive to sensory posturing issues centered around main senses such as sight, sound, smell, and texture. Since the way ASD has varying effects from person to person, it is important to have a general base as to what can help these individuals as a whole improve their quality of life. This can be done by having an established sleep pattern, as having a good quality of sleep will lead to lowering symptoms of autism experience the next day. There is a high prevalence of sleep problems that is common among children with ASD, between the ranges of 50 to 80% found in children aged 1 to 3. Sleep problems typically start occurring when a child is around 30 months. However, it is still reported by adults with ASD as it can be chronic. The causes of this bad sleep is from late bedtime, trouble falling asleep, night awakenings, and a small amount of sleep period. It can also be related to things like bedwetting, anxiety, restless sleep, snoring, night tears, illnesses, and social community difficulties. Understanding what is causing the sleep problems can be easier for the caregivers to support their children. Sleep problems are among the most pressing concerns for caregivers and families of children with ASD. However, with great importance, how sleep affects behavior is talked about very minimally. A Stanford University psychologist, Ruth O'Hara, said sleep disturbance impacts cognition, it impacts mood, and it impacts behavior. Poor sleep is considered to be less than 10 hours for autistic individuals. Typically, it shouldn't take more than over 30 minutes for children to fall asleep. For ASD children, it takes about 11 minutes longer than that. Many studies have been conducted that showcase that autistic individuals who have lit little sleep experience magnified symptoms of the disorder. Their social skills are severely poor, they are more prone to agitation, experience high levels of repetitive behavior, and are more hyperactive or have very little energy, and they're also much easily distracted. As well, they tend to lose focus quicker, leading to poor educational performance. Sleep is extremely important for all individuals, even ones that are not diagnosed with ASD and need a good sleep pattern. When people don't get a high quality of sleep, the next day they are more likely to be cranky, moody, and non-social. The same goes for individuals with autism, but at a much more important level. ASD affects parts of the brain which control emotion, communication, and body movement. As such, they need more sleep so that the brain can develop, grow, and recharge properly for the upcoming day. In general, a high quality of sleep is found to be 12 to 14 hours of sleep per day for ages 1 to 3, 10 to 12 hours for ages 3 to 6, 10 to 11 hours for ages 7 to 12, and 10 hours for all other ages. Individuals with ASD thrive in routine settings and having an established bedtime, bedtime routines, and comfortable sleep environment which can positively benefit the individual. This is an important topic as the strength of autistic individuals typically lie outside social settings and sleep can affect social interactions in both a positive and a negative way. With a good quality of sleep, the individual can have a much better performance throughout the day and a low performance with poor sleep. Better sleep isn't going to get rid of the symptoms associated with autism, but it will help to reduce the symptoms associated with ASD.